Hello everyone, I'm Shirley Tarawali. I'm Assistant Director General at ILRI, the International Livestock Research Institute, based in Kenya. I'm also Chair of the Global Agenda for Sustainable Livestock. And the Global Agenda is a multi-stakeholder partnership that brings together different livestock sector actors from all across the world, really striving to improve the sustainability of the livestock sector and its contribution to development. Of course, pastoral systems are part of that diversity and like all parts of the livestock sector, need to transition towards greater sustainability. And there's really tremendous opportunities for that transition to be a positive one for people, livelihoods, for the environment and for biodiversity. For me, a key to that transition is recognizing that even within pastoral systems, there is still diversity. So we need to think about that transition in relation to that diversity. And that means things like where productivity, market access, service access can be improved so that we can all benefit from animal source foods coming from these landscapes where no other food production is possible we can focus on that, but we also need to be mindful not to mess up the environment in the process. But in some cases, the focus rather needs to be on the role of pastoral landscapes in providing ecosystem services. So we need opportunities, incentives for pastoralists to really play their roles as environmental stewards. Actions that help value and restore rangelands are really important because we understand much more now about the roles and importance and value of rangelands of pastoral systems their roles in watersheds in the environment and in conserving biodiversity and importantly and increasingly their roles in resilience and adaptation to a very variable and changing climate so lots of opportunities along with a challenge about how do we be smart about where we do the right thing at the right time so it's not one size fits all i think that the international year of rangelands and pastoralists is really important for raising the profile of these opportunities and the supportive actions that are needed towards more sustainable pastoral systems